In this tutorial, we are going to use Global Mapper in order to create a 3D animation that looks just like this one and export it as a video. Welcome to GeoCarto, a channel dedicated to GIS, cartography and geoscience. So subscribe if you want to get more tutorials. So open Global Mapper and then we are going to import our digital elevation model. In order to do this, you can click either on open data files or you can simply click on this open data files from here. So I'm going to click on this open data files. So then navigate to your work folder and click on your digital elevation model, then click on open. And then click on yes to specify that this is a digital elevation model. After importing your digital elevation model, you can play with the colors from here. You can change the color of your digital elevation model. For example, let's take this one. So now we are going to digitize the pathway that we are going to use in order to get our 3D animation, our flight through. So in order to do this, we are going to use the digitizing tools of Global Mapper. Specifically, we are going to use this one, create line feature. I will click on it and now I will go ahead and choose the path that my animation will use. So let's, for example, imagine that I want to get these mountains and this lake. Then I will get back to my start point. I will go ahead and start to add points and digitize my pathway. This is just a simple polygon that I'm going to draw. So when you arrive to your start point, then right click and you will get this window for the name just give it a random name and then just click on ok so now after that i created my pathway i will go ahead and create my flight through so in order to do this we are going to use this plane button i will click on it create 3d fly through and from here we are going to create our 3d animation so the parameters that we are going to change are mainly those three. So we can change the elevation of your camera, here the velocity, and the duration of your animation. So for me, I will keep the elevation at 1500. And for the velocity, I will just set it to default. And for the duration, I will just put 40 seconds. And then I will click on generate flight through data. As you can see, we got our this new columns. Now I will just click on OK. Generally speaking, if you want to get the 3D model of your digital elevation model in Global Mapper, you can simply click on this button, show 3D view. And you can play with your digital elevation model. You can even change the vertical exaggeration by clicking on this button. And you can change the background you can play with it and choose the background that you want. If you want to get the 3D animation, all what you need to do is just click on this play button and then click on OK. So there we go, as you can see, you can now watch this 3D fly through. Now, if you want to get this animation as a video, just close the window and then click again on 3D view. And we will click on this save fly through button. And from here you can change the resolution of your video. You can choose for example up to 1080p. I will choose this one. For the frame rate you can go as high as 30 frames per second. And that's all. You can now just click on OK. Choose then where you want to save your video name it and then click on save and just wait until the end of the export at the end of the download you will get your animation as a video double click on it and there you go as you can see now you got your 3d animation as a video so i hope that you got some useful information from this tutorial if so please like it and subscribe if you want to get more of this kind of tutorials